Welcome to our channel. We are Technic Force and we help grow your business online. Please hit the subscribe button to get more updates. Facebook Commerce Manager Guide What is Commerce Manager? Commerce Manager is a central tool for all of your online selling activity across Facebook and Instagram. From here, you can manage your product catalogs, set up a shop, view sales activity, and enable checkout if your business is eligible. Whether you run a small shop or work with an e-commerce partner to manage your inventory, Commerce Manager can help you be a more efficient and effective seller. To start, go to business.facebook.com slash commerce. This is the Commerce Manager. On the left side, click your name and you will see the list of your business accounts. Click on it. Now, as you can see, you can view all the pages where you have set up a shop. You can type in here to search by name or you can filter, view all, the commerce accounts, and view onboarding saves. Here you can manage your list. You can also see your Facebook shop's ID right here. If you can find your shop, just switch account. You have here the catalogs. Use a catalog to upload and manage your inventory. You need a catalog to add items to your shop or to feature items in your ads. You can search by name or ID. You can add catalog and manage list. You can see your catalog down here and your catalog ID. If you want to delete your catalog, just click on manage list, click on your catalog, then click delete catalogs. Click done. You can select one catalog to connect to your Facebook shop. You can edit this catalog, but you cannot switch to a different catalog later on. You can click on a catalog and view the page linked to it and manage your inventory. Now choose a shop and you will be redirected to the commerce section of that Facebook shop. The overview section, you can add products to your catalog, you can customize your shop, and publish your shop. If a shop on your page is not approved, it will show you the warning sign that your shop can't be published. You can click see details to see why your shop can't be published. You can also view the suggested actions for your shop. You can appeal and request for another review. You can view the number of items in this catalog and manage items. Manage your Facebook shop and click here to connect to your Instagram account. You can view the insights of your Facebook shop for the last 28 days. And you can add more products to your shop to give your customers more buying options. You can see your top products and top tag content. You can also create posts with tag content to engage customers and boost sales. Let's proceed to catalog. Click catalog at the left side. In the catalog section, you can see your items, sets, issues, data sources, and events. Let's start with the items. Under items, you can view all the items added in your catalog, filtered by active, archived, and all items. Issues, under attributes, you can view the inventory that is in stock, view all brand, view all brand new items, filter by brand, category and price. Under sets, you can view all the collections that you have created, view the items inside the collection, sales channels, and shops. You can even view the issues that you must fix and the opportunities as recommended actions for the items in your shop. Under data sources, you can view the details of the updates that you have done on your catalog's inventory. And under events, you can set up tracking to run retargeted ads. You can add an events data source to your website or mobile app to track interactions with products, track whether the products that people interact with are eligible to run in retargeted ads, troubleshoot and fix issues with content ID mismatches. You need to set up tracking Choose whether you want to set up tracking on a mobile app. On your mobile app, you'll need to add a Facebook SDK. On a website, you'll need to install a Metapixel. So choose one in here and then click Next. You will need this for running ads. Under Shop section, you can view the shop that is linked to the items inside the catalog. Under Ads, you can start creating ads to get started with traffic ads, where you can run ads with at least four items in your catalog. In the insights, you can see the performance of your shop, showing the number of visitors, product page views, top tag content, etc. Under catalog, 
you can see insights about products or collections in your catalog. If you can see any insights for products during your selected time range, select a different time range, change your selected apps, or adjust your filter. Once you create a collection, you'll see insights for it here. Under Performance, you can see Funnel. If there's no activity during the selected date range to show insights for your shop, try posting more content or selecting a different date range to get insights. You can see traffic, shopping behavior, on Facebook sales, and website events. If you have a Metapixel connected, metrics reported vary depending upon whether you use on-site checkout to sell directly on Facebook and Instagram or if purchase occur on your website. Under Audience, you can see where your customers are visiting your shop from, their gender, age, and languages spoken. If you don't see any insights, that means you need at least 100 people in this audience. Click Learn More for more info on how to grow your audience. Tag Content See conversion metrics by specific products and variants, and by format, Reels, Instagram Video, Live Shopping on Facebook, and Live Shopping on Instagram. See insights for tag content that has been published by sellers and their approved creators. Split by type organic or paid content. So you need to add tags to the content you share, such as posts or your story, or select a new date range to see insights. Awareness. If you don't see any insights, select a new date or you need to increase visits to your shop to see more insights. Off meta events. Connect a data source to a website or app sales. You need to connect a Metapixel, SDK, or other data source to see ads to cart, purchases, and sales on your website from people who have recently visited your shop. So click Connect Data Source to start. Let's proceed to To-Do List. You'll see your shop summary and get up-to-date assessments on how your shop is running. You can keep track of all the ways you can improve your shop, making your shop ready for customers by taking action on any required tasks, exploring more ways to grow. Down here, you can see your outstanding issues, filter by account. If you want to know why you have these outstanding issues, click See Details for more info and you can request review. And under Settings, in the general, this is where you actually can deactivate a commerce account simply by clicking Edit. Down here, you can see Deactivate Commerce Account. Just click that and click Save. Localization. Manage how your shop is set up for countries or regions where you don't have localized settings. Select a country or region by clicking this. Then choose a country you want to localize your shop for. Then click Next. Catalog. This is where you have some settings for your catalog. Under Catalog, you can view the catalog name and ID. You can also edit image cropping for carousel and collection ads and also single ads. You can choose from the options to fill the ad with an image, fit the image to the ad, or crop and resize the image to fit the ad. You may also select the notifications that you want to receive about your catalog. Business Assets, where you can review and edit the accounts you've connected to sell your products. You can also connect additional Facebook pages or Instagram accounts to your shop by clicking Connect. Checkout Method, this is how customers around the world will check out by default. Permissions, and Customer Support. Here you can claim email address chargebacks email address and you can edit shop contact information to let your customers on facebook and instagram know how to get in touch with you if they have questions or need help with an order as a seller you need commerce manager to effectively sell to your customers on facebook and that's it before we end this video let me introduce to you leads to list by Technic Force. Grab unlimited leads right off Facebook, Google, and YouTube. Add into your autoresponder. Facebook and Google leads your autoresponder. No website, no opt in, no fake emails, and unlimited scaling. This is list building ultimate. Connect with any Facebook page or Google account in a matter of seconds. Run Facebook and Google lead gen ads and send leads directly into your autoresponder. Send welcome emails containing access or other details to anyone who signs up. 100% accurate Facebook and Google emails. You can virtually guarantee this is the user's main account. Leads to list will help you no matter what kind of business you run. Product vendors, affiliate marketers, e-com sellers, local businesses, and a lot more. So what are you waiting for? Get leads to list now. Just go to getleadstolist.in. I hope you find this video helpful. And thanks for watching.